Thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. If you want to design and build a beautiful website, you can do it all in one place with Squarespace. My test! Mike, where are you? <laughs> Oh man, I hope I don't have to go toilet halfway through. Welcome to another studio vlog. In this video, I am going to be painting a future school library in Cambodia. I wanted to show you guys the entire process from initial ideation, client feedback, changes that come with that, um, the problems that arose, and then the final piece, which I'm super, super happy with. All you skippers out there, skip ahead five milliseconds because I'm about to show you the final result. Boom! Now that we've got that over and done with, it's time to start the process. I hope you like this video and I'll see you later. First sighting in the school, that place behind me is called Happiness House. Thank you, is that name? I like these colors. I might include them in the painting. Do you want to talk me through? Yeah, so I was going to do white like this. I knew it wasn't working as well with the contrast, but I didn't want to do a dark color for a mural, especially for a school, because the school itself is already white, and that's the vision they have for it, so I don't want to intrude and do a, a full black, which I love the most, as a piece on its own. But it's not going to work in this context. So then we, we're playing around with like creams, blue, things like that for, for existing. I do like this. If we can get a blue that colour, that would be nice. <laughs> what, a nice digital RGB blue? Surely there's an Eve's Klein somewhere. filmed enough to explain what was happening here um, and I think it would be more concise if I just explained it. At this point we had shown Mr. Safara who's the founder of Hello School the concepts and he said it was good but I could tell that he was a little bit reserved and it wasn't sharing his exact thoughts so I kind of asked him what he thought about this, 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 kind of asked him questions about the things that he didn't like and what I gathered from that conversation was that it was a little bit too abstract for the context of this mural and that um, for the outside of the school it was a little bit dark as well because we went we, we showed him the blue i went back and i created a new concept instead of having a lot of busy elements everywhere which made it seem a lot less easy to understand i think i created like more of a scene which is i think what he wanted and after i sent that to him he sent me a bunch of reference images which is something that i usually ask for at the start but i didn't think that he already had a vision for the school already i don't know why i just assumed that but that was a mistake on my behalf so while the images that he sent through were not unusual um or overly complex i'm not well practiced in painting with acrylic based paints especially like that if i went ahead and did the mural in that style i wouldn't be happy and he probably wouldn't be happy with the end result because we'd be finding a medium between what i wanted and what he wanted my mum commissioned a local artist to the outside of the school and mrs safara asked me to paint in the meditation room which is the future library which i thought was amazing in my style so it was i think the best outcome of all of the options that we had. But basically the takeaway is never assume that you know what the client wants. Always ask questions first. But in the end, I'm really, really happy with how the mural came out. So I hope you enjoy the next few minutes of bliss. My favorite part of the video, enjoy. <laughs>
it. Yeah, that's right, we will. like this video and I hope you like the end result let me know what you think it's the first mural I've painted in a long time and I actually want to do some more so I want to thank Mr. Safara for allowing me to paint his school I want to thank my mom for initiating the project because she was volunteering earlier this year at the school so that's how we found out about it rocket for helping me with the camera work and also a sit honey look at me I want to thank you for assisting me in painting over the blue. I just want to say thank you again to Squarespace for sponsoring this video. Having sponsors really allows me to do the passion projects that I love, which I think makes for, for better viewing for you guys. Squarespace is a website building platform that I have used for the past four years. Four years. It's a company that I love and so that I'm happy to share with you guys. And I would love for you to try them out. If you go to squarespace.com slash peach, you will get a free trial, two weeks, and a discount of 10% if you choose to go forward with Squarespace, which you probably will because it's really, really good. I hope you like this video. Thank you for watching. And I don't know what else to say. Goodbye. I really enjoyed making this video. My armpit smell. I love you, subscribers. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> My armpit smell, I just want to tell you guys. <laughs> You did well, honey. You did very well. Thanks, honey. You look cute. Watch these videos now to be um, immortal. <laughs>